Picasso's Garden. I draw him as he sleeps. He tears from my skin like a necessary thorn, directs which way my limbs will bend, how pungent the scent of each blossom. He plants me next to hollyhocks and wing seeds of pine, places his paintbrush in the tomato can, demands I grow near wisteria. I witness her shells in the breeze, how she dabs the perfume of mauve water between her legs, offers him the sympathy of a dandelion. In spring, a peony tempts him with her red fist. He will part her like a cheap carnation, and there's nothing I can do about it. I was born with a nub that will not open, a womb blank as canvas. He says we all must sacrifice, but I stop giving it away, shut down my nectar and bury its scent. He swallows me anyway like thistles of burdock, makes me believe he loves my bitterness. I endure the scent of peat on his lips, pack his brushes and pretend he is leaving. But we carry one another's seed. He will chase me into the afterlife. Oh, where is my mouth? I think of silence. How difficult for a mute to speak. This is the profile I must not sketch. Hornets humming along the edge of his jaw.